go, Phil. So today, I am doing my strength day number one since uh, triathlon training has been pretty hectic this week. 14 sessions of training throughout the weeks. So this is gonna be the first weight training session. We are gonna be doing condensed conjugate. I'm gonna be doing a heavy max effort, one rep sumo deadlift today. But we're first gonna do dynamic effort upper body. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my bent over rows. And guess who I have with me? This bald headed kid right here. And I'm gonna have him take me through the warm up. So let's do it. Oh, get weird. Get weird here. Back is getting weird. I was back, bro. What's going on, sir? How are you? All right, so. Moving on to our dynamic effort with the upper body. Like I said before in the last video, the main focus for me is gonna be back strength, right? And back strength and explosive strength because most of the stuff that I'm doing requires my back and not any pressing movement. So for me to do a bench press for dynamic effort wouldn't really be as conducive to the sport that I'm actually in. So I'm taking a row variation. We're gonna attach bands over the top like we're doing right here. We're gonna go nine sets of three. Right now it's 55%. So we're gonna stay right here and do nine sets of very limited rest back and forth the whole time sets or workup sets that's 405 I haven't done this in forever so it's gonna feel it out um, I'm hoping to at least get 475 465 if I get more than that I'll be happy coming off the injury coming off the surgery I'll take it but I think I can get as much as I, I need to on this one So I lied, I got 500 in See what happens when you lock in. It comes up a little bit easier. All right, so check it out. So we're moving on to our supplemental lift. We're gonna go ahead and do a snatch grip deadlift off a slight deficit. So I'm taking two mats, roughly about an inch off the ground, and we're gonna go ahead and do a snatch grip position. It's gonna work the upper back. It's also gonna work the quads out of the hole. Really good when you're talking about driving acceleration through the ground.
All right, so we are done with our supplementals. Now we're gonna move on to accessory exercises. I'm gonna hit the hamstrings a little bit more now with the knee bend. So we're gonna go uh, glute ham raise or GHR. And then I'm gonna go ahead and superset that with a bent knee calf raise to hit the soleus. Really good for runners, um, especially for me doing a lot of running. Um, strengthening up the soleus is very important. That flexion extension, again with the dorsiflexion, plantar flexion, we want that. But we also wanna make sure that we're stabilizing the knee. So you're gonna see how I stabilize the knee in that low position. All right, guys, so that's a wrap. Uh, you guys want to find out more details on my protocol and on the methods of training that I use for my athletes and myself, check out my mentorship program. Link is in the description down below. It's a one-time fee and you get access for life. Plus, it's 50% off right now for a very limited time. So check it out. If you're looking to rock some of the apparel, the Daru Strong apparel, link is also in the description below. Just brought it out. So we have three, three designs, very unique designs, I would say. All right, if you guys want to find out more, make sure you subscribe. If you want to see more of my training, make sure you hit the notification so you know when my videos come out. Also, be on the lookout. I just finished writing up the Hybrid Prime program. So that will be out in July, middle to end of July. So be on the lookout for that. And I'll see you again next time. Peace.